So, good afternoon and welcome to the Hallmark Security Cheshire Association Football League. Today's quick YouTube video is all about the application process for joining the Cheshire Football League. How do you become a member of the league? How do you apply? What's the time scales? What are the things we expect? Where can we get the information from? Just really to help any club that might be thinking about applying for um, Cheshire League, be it 2017-18 or any season after that because the, uh, the, the requirements generally stay the same season to season with, with the odd slight variation, but that's mainly instigated by the FA. So if I just go through um, the timescales, that's the most important thing. The cutoff for applications is the 31st of March every year. So in 10 days time, 31st of March at midnight, if your application to the Cheshire League, and that means the application form plus the um, application fee, um, they need to be with um, our secretary and you can email secretary at cheshirefl.com for those forms to get them filled in. Um, the fees involved, you have a £25 ground vetting fee for somebody from our ground vetting committee to come and inspect your ground and give you some pointers as to work that might need to be done um, or to check that you do meet the standard and a £100 application fee um, as per league rule. So once you've um, decided to apply and you've paid your fees, you actually have to speak to the league that you're currently in. You have to tell them that you are applying to the Cheshire Football League and we will inform them also. But it's courtesy for the team um, who are leaving a league to join us or looking to join us and um, to tell their league, let their league know that they're applying to the Cheshire Football League because Lee, our secretary, will write to your league secretary to say we've had an application from X, Y and Z club team to come and join our league next season. If you go to CheshireFL.com and click on the downloads link, there's a whole series of documents there. But the key ones that you need to look at are Appendix A, B, C, and then there's a document about grounds and facilities. And that gives you the basic requirements of Step 7 football. And what we say in the Cheshire Football League is that to join the league, you have to meet the Step 7 requirements. The Step 7 um, is basically our Premier Division. But if you're coming in to our league um, in League 2, you know, rather than having loads and loads of work to do, like expanding your changing rooms and doing it all up and putting dugouts in, if you meet the criteria on the day one, then you can go straight through the league, get promotion every season without having to worry about meeting the ground vetting criteria. For our, a copy of our league rules, which will give you a bit of a flavour of the league as well, you can actually download the Cheshire FL app, which is available on the uh, on the App Store and Google Play for Android. Um, all you need to do is go to the, the either the App Store or um, Google Play and just type in Cheshire Football League and you'll see the, the, the badge that you can see up here. That will appear on your uh, on your list and you can just download it. And in there are league contacts, league rules, the playing season dates, the meeting dates. We expect you to come to a meeting every three months. Um, normally start the season, November, February. Um, and then as we get to the back end of the season, when we go into changing our rules and voting in, new applicant clubs, for, ex for, uh, for example, um, we, do, we do need you at those meetings. Um, in terms of the process then, once we've got your application in, you've paid your fees, you've met the criteria, um, the ground vetting committee, the £25 you've paid, will come and visit your ground. They'll help you, they'll point you in the right direction. There may be massive, massive work that needs to be done, or there might be small little things just to bring you up to standard. And you will get a report back from the ground vetting committee to say, these are the things that we've spotted, these are the things that you need to do, or actually you've, you've passed with flying colours. And the ground vetting committee will then come to the next league management committee and say, here's a list of 12 clubs, 12 teams that have applied to the Cheshire Football League. Um, these are the ones that we recommend because they meet all the standards, all the criteria right here, right now. And at that point, um, Lee will then write, or the secretary, Lee Taylor, will then write out to those club secretaries and invite them to the constitutional meeting. And basically this is the meeting where each club team applicant can have their, their say, they can stand up in front of a, the, all the member clubs to say um, the league they're in, how long they've been running, how many players they've got, what they've won recently and why they want to join the league. Um, and if there is, for example, this year we have 
four a, mi a minimum of four spaces. Um, so if we get eight applications, it's it's going to be a vote, and the clubs, the member clubs, will vote based on the, the business case, to put, the case you put forward in your five minutes talking to the floor. Um, once those clubs have gone through that voting process, you'll then um, be elected into the league at the AGM in June, and then you join um, the league from that point going forward, and you go through the process of filling in your affiliation and all those different kind of things as we uh, as we progress to season 2017. Hopefully this has been useful. Um, if you do need any more information, please email Lee Taylor, our league secretary, che at secretary at cheshirefl.com. Or if you do need any help and advising regarding links um, on our webpage, please contact me, chairman at cheshirefl.com also. Thank you.